This is a contrast NAN CT scan of a 41 years old male patient. Patient is a known case of hepatitis C. Please observe wavy outline of liver, suggestive of chronic hepatic parenchymal disease, resulting in hepatic cirrhosis. Portal vein measured approximately 1.2 cm. Now, please see this maslian lying in the lower part of right lobe of liver. It shows no homogeneous enhancement. It lies at the confluence of the segment number 5 and 6. So, patient is a known case of hepatitis C and this is a hepatocellular carcinoma. Now, please observe spleen. Spleen was enlarged, is enlarged and its vertical span was approximately 15.7 cm. There is evidence of portal hypertension. Dilated blood vessels are present along the curvatures of stomach. Now, these are the horseshoe kidneys. Now, this is right kidney here. Its renal pelvis is baggy, extra renal, and directed anteriorly. This is left kidney. Its renal pelvis is also directed anteriorly. It is extra renal and baggy. Now, this is the isthmus connecting lower poles of both the kidneys. So there is presence of the horseshoe kidneys along with there. And there is a cyst in the left kidney as well. Now one thing that we usually forget is while reporting that we must always look the lung parenchyma. Now please observe multiple small nodular soft tissue density shadows in both the lungs like this one here this one some of them are intrapulmonary while others are peripherally located some of these are plural based and subplural in locations like this one here these are typical of the metastatic lanes Multiple intrapulmonary nodules are present, like this one here, this one here. So, while whensoever looking upon any intra-abdominal malignancy while see, while the reporting CT scan, since lower part of the chest has already been scanned, one must always look for any metastatic lane in the lungs.